One, two, and I believe that there's a third one coming. This is one of my favorite types of videos to do. Let's do an unboxing of an insane amount of Christmas decorations. If that's something you wanna see, then just keep watching. All right, this has got to be one of the biggest Christmas hauls I've ever done because as you can see the monstrosity behind me, all of the decorations from the regular tree went on the big tree. And then all the decorations for the big tree stayed on the big tree. So here's what's happening. This tree behind me is incredible. Like I'm obsessed with it. The tree to my left, this way, is terrible. It's just, it's literally how I would describe when you know you're decorating a tree and you're like but it doesn't look amazing so i think that this is a great learning moment that i can show you guys how i go full tilt now i'm hoping that while i'm hanging out with you guys drinking my third cup of coffee today my peppermint mocha that the other parcel gets delivered because i want to show you my full plan and i don't think that you see this coming you might see a part of it coming but not the whole thing so here's the deal the tree over here is a twinkly tree. I've shared this tree before, but here's the cool part is the lights can change. You can literally just like use the remote control or the app and change the colors of the lights. So this year I was like, let's change it up. And I have been loving the like vintage look multicolor lights. And I was like, let's do like a vintage tree. And I tried to decorate it and it looked lame as potatoes. Like it was terrible. So I thought time to shop and none of the stores in town have anything. Michael's, terrible this year. And we don't have Hobby Lobby and cool stores like that in Canada. So I placed an online order. For the record, zero of this is sponsored, but I think I'm gonna put you onto a lot of stuff. Here's where you're gonna be like, wait, I'm sorry, what? Let me just show you the color theme. Yes, that's pink. And yes, Andre said he's fine with it. So my inspiration, this is the part that's not shocking. I want to do like Candyland sweet shop type of idea, but the colorways of this tree are going to be all pink and green with a touch of red. What am I doing? I don't even know. So let's jump into this. So I have this big box. I have an even bigger box behind me. And then I have a very cool delivery on the way that I'm literally, okay. Are you like this too, where you refresh the tracking number about 50 times throughout the day? Cause I think I've refreshed it easily without exaggeration 20 times today. It's out for delivery. So I mean, FedEx, you better deliver on this one, literally, because I will cry if you don't, because we're flying out tomorrow. There's glitter all over this. This is incredible. Okay, let's jump into this. Let's do this. So I'm gonna have my coffee. We're gonna decorate together. There's gonna be glitter all over me. Oh my God. I have never ordered from this store before. I will link as much as I can down below. I believe the name of the store was like Craft Outlet. This could have gone totally sideways. I was like, I don't even know what I'm ordering from. It could be terrible, but they had the coolest stuff. And I'm just being honest, no stores had anything this year. Like the selection was terrible. There is gonna be glitter everywhere. So this is the first piece. Everything that I ordered, I ordered in multiples. Some I ordered seven of them, some I ordered four, some I ordered like nine. This one is like a fuzzy, glittery pink. I was kind of going for, as per usual, like the Whoville look and this totally reminded me of you know the girl at the beginning of whoville of beginning of grinch like the one with jim carrey and she's like do it for me Stu." do it for me Stu." <laughs> and she has like the pink thing i'm obsessed with her i think she's so cute so i got six of these oh like seven a lot like this this alone is a full vibe and i'm here for it i like the glitter is like falling out of it you guys i vacuum until like march to get the glitter out of the house. It's fine. Okay, this reminds me of that Whoville girl. So this is like a striped dark pink. So really the colorways that I'm going for are like a dark pink, like a fuchsia and green. And you're on this journey with me because this could be a complete disaster. And I just hope I have enough to make it Angie chaos level. So I got these pink curly cues and I got quite a few of these also. And these are like, these are not glittered and they're almost in like a sock. And I just wanna say so far, I mean, you can tell right away if you order from somewhere, by the way, just a tip, don't order stuff like this from Amazon. Every single time that I'm, I'm in like desperation mode and I order off of Amazon, it's 
trash cannolis, like the worst quality. Don't do it. This, so far, this is great. So, and the prices were like really reasonable. The only reason that I got like slapped across the face was the shipping because again, I'm Canadian and apparently we are a long lost place that nobody's ever heard of and they don't ship to. So I paid stupid for shipping, but it's fine. We're here. So one, three, four, I think I got like six or seven of these also. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. I feel like there should be alcohol in this. Oh, I'm looking at the clock. It's 4 p.m. right now. I'm starting to get nervous because they're not gonna show up. Okay, okay, okay. This is one of my favorite ones I think that I ordered and I just hope that it works out. The, gl the glitter seeping out of this box. Oh my gosh. Okay, I hope I got a lot of this one because this one is incredible. Like this is truly the vibe that I'm going for. These are sick. So it's like sprinkles. I mean, this is basically like if I could have a logo, it would be this because this is everything and more. There's like icing sugar, glitter, sprinkles on a pink spirally thing. Incredible. So what I'm realizing is that I love a tree. Like you can see the tree behind me. It's ridiculous, but there's barely any just regular ornaments hanging in there. And if you didn't see my hack that I shared on my Instagram that cut the time in like half of like the jumbo ornaments that I got, Here's where I went wrong with that tree. And I'm gonna show you guys, like the, I'm gonna take you through, that's gonna be its own video of like taking a tree from like basic to exquisite. But I think the secret is these, like a picks and sticks. They're called sprays, like a floral spray is what they're called. I just never write that in my post because people are gonna think I'm talking about like a spray, like a hairspray. Please tell me I got a lot of these. Oh, I did. So four, five, six, seven. Here for it. Oh. And then there's four of these, which I also love. So this is where the red is gonna come into play. Ooh, this is cute with my outfit. All buff bunny, all on sale. I love, like, honestly, can I just tell you my favorite thing ever? And I don't know if you guys have noticed this. I like stopped doing sponsored things because I just, I wanted to share stuff that, I mean, I always share stuff I love, but I just stopped altogether. But this, I am here for it. And I wanna pick up doing, you know, promotions and all that stuff and partnering with companies again and doing it in a way that it's on my terms but the behind the scenes of the stuff that you guys don't see is ridiculous the amount that i get taken through the ringer by certain companies there's a reason why i stuck with this company and why i said yes to this company buff bunny is amazing and i legitimately wear all their stuff and that's my closet is filled with their stuff and reasonable prices female owned love her and it's cute af and I have a discount code now, which makes me so happy because before I could just share a link, which was great, but now I'm like, I can actually offer you guys something. So it's just Angie B, always. I'm here for this and my matching. I wish I would got more. That's what I was thinking. I'm like, if I like one of them, I'm gonna wish that I got more. I only got four of this one, but still good. And I would say that the quality is better than Michael's because if this was from Michael's, one of these balls would have fallen off. If you know, you know, and you know that I'm telling the truth because if it's happened to you, you're like, yep, how many times have I unboxed something with you guys? And I'm like, well, that's broken. I feel like we should do like a clock, like FedEx, like tick tock, tick tock. <laughs> we should play a game. How many times can Angie check the tracking number while we're, see it's on, I'm not lying. It's literally on my phone. It's the last thing I checked. Like I have an actual problem with it. The worst is when I start Christmas shopping and then I like want the gifts to be delivered. It still says out for delivery. I mean, what did you think, Angie? Like, it's not at the door, so. It's been out for delivery since 10.03 a.m., which is good luck because that's my magic time number because that's the time I was born. So I love 10.03. You know how some people see 11.11 on the clock? I always see 10.03. So it's good luck, right? It's gotta be delivered. <laughs> this is, this is, oh my God. I'm not even exaggerating. This thing is filled. What is wrong with me? <laughs> The end of this video is gonna be filmed in the dark because the sun is literally setting and it's four freaking o'clock. It's four o'clock and the sun is setting. No wonder I struggle with seasonal sadness. Okay. <gasps> what? Did I get a, my question for every single one of these is gonna be like, did I get a lot of you? What? These are, I just heard a, I just heard a car door, but it didn't sound like a truck. So I don't think it's a FedEx truck. These are like pink macaroons. <gasps> 
I cannot even handle your incredibleness. Please, there we go. It looks like real ice cream. It kind of looks like an ice cream cookie more than a macaroon. But this is the vibe I'm going for. Okay, so here is the actual colorway that I'm going for. These two, this like this is literally the inspo. So I have a picture of like the inspo. It, it was a Pinterest picture of a girl's outfit and it was fuchsia pink, like this exact pink with a ton of green. And I was like, that's it. That's what I want to do. So sometimes your inspiration can come from other things. So I have these little ice cream cones that are not on a pick. Oh, it's like a, oh, that can still work. So what I've been doing whenever there's like a rope like this, I grab a pipe cleaner for any of it. It just makes it so much easier. And help, by the way, you'll see online, I'm seeing them this year, like tinsel, special tinsel hangers. Girl, that's a pipe cleaner. That's a glittery pipe cleaner. Go to Walmart, get yourself a pack of 50. We're good to go. Frugal, says the girl opening the gigantic box of useless items. More ice cream cones. I think I got three of these. The things that were like random, like an ice cream cone, I didn't get a ton. There is gonna be sprinkles and glitter and chaos everywhere. Should we refresh our tracking number? Just kidding. Okay, lollipop. Oh, here's the other thing that I didn't want to happen. So I was looking at these lollipops and you'll, I, you'll see it when I say it. I didn't want it to look like a baby shower thing. And when you go into like pastel pinks and blues and stuff, it, I feel like some trees, not hating on any, just sometimes I just feel like, I saw a tree yesterday on Instagram and I was like, it's so pretty, but it literally looks like a gender reveal party. Like, especially when you start doing pastel pink and pastel blue, I feel like that's what it looks like. And when you start adding little ribbons. So what I think I'm gonna do is take this ribbon off because I feel like there's so much more potential without the ribbon. And then when you add the ribbon, it's like, welcome to my baby shower. <laughs> Apparently I'm a sassy decorator. Okay, then, so same as the big lollipop. Angie, did you only buy one dang lollipop? No, I would never. I am never the girl that buys one thing. I'm just not, it's not, who, it's not who I am. I got these smaller ones that are like a double, it's the exact same thing. It has like a felt, a felt detail. The ribbon has got to go, I think. What do you think? Do you think the ribbon should go or do you think I should leave it? I think the ribbon should go and it'll just make it better. In the grand scheme of things, it's not gonna make a difference, but I just, okay, I'm showing you close-ups because you need to see like, the quality on this is really good. And it's not trash where it's like gonna fall apart and break. I'm so impressed. And I know the prices on these things. Like these things were like, $4.99, $5.99, like these weren't like $16.99 pieces. There was stores that had the exact same ones for $16.99. Okay, so I have a couple littler ones. I have more macaroons. Oh, this is also the colorway. Love this, wait. Oh, I got excited yesterday and I took some of it out of the box. I have to show you, I have to show you, I have to show you. <gasps> this is literally like we're like girlfriends having coffee and I'm showing you all my treasures. Oh, there is another lollipop. These are also, like this is really the colorway that I'm going for. So this and this, green and pink. I got a ton of these, a ton of, oh, and then there's an extra lollipop. Love this. It almost looks like a, like a popsicle or something, I don't know. Totally works. And then honorable mentions, not from this like craft online thing, from Walmart. This could suck, like this could be terrible, but I wanted something green and the red is almost like reddish pink. And these are dirty cheap. I got four of them from Walmart. Here's what I'm thinking. Tinsel is like vintage. And if I'm gonna do the multicolor, tinsel could work. And it's also reflective and it would be really pretty with the multicolor lights. You're gonna be a part of the unboxing, but you're also gonna be a part of the decorating, which I'm gonna do with a martini. And if it sucks, well, it's gonna suck together. So I got a bunch of these. In Canada, Walmart is not super dirty cheap, but I bet you in America, these are probably like a dollar or two. Oh, there's the cutest tumbler from Walmart and I saw it online and it's like $2.98 in the States. Canada, $14.99. Don't you just love it here? So $7.98 for these in Canada, I'm sure they're like a dollar 99 in the States, but I got four of them, which is probably not enough for the tree, but it's fine. I can Instacart more. Where are those spirally things? That's what made me think of all this. So these spirally things, I got miniature ones. They're like a bit, well, they're not a bit smaller. They're a lot smaller, but they have like the, they're like pink polka dot instead. 
with a green in the middle. That was cute. Another lollipop. Oh, it's a different lollipop. Oh shoot, did I just get one? Nope, you never get one of anything, Ninja, you know this. Yeah, I got two, I think. So, giant lollipop. See what I mean? There's no bow on this, so it's better. Ooh, he doesn't feel stable though. All right, so he's in the plastic. Oh, I'm also thinking of doing some DIY candies because I did do some DIY for this one because it's very hard to find jumbo candy. So I might do some jumbo, like Tootsie Rolls or something. Not Tootsie, what are you saying, Angie? Not a Tootsie Roll, like a, like a candy in a wrapper. I wanna do that. This obviously is not gonna stay in this wrapper. Can I take, oh, there we go, there we go. Yeah, without the bow, I feel like it's so much better. You can see all the glitter and every, oh, so good. So there's glitter on here, there's sprinkles. I'm here for the sprinkles. I just wanna say, you might be thinking the same thing. It's a lot of pink, Angie. There's not a lot of green happening. I know, I know, I hear you, I hear you. FedEx, where are you? These are like little, oh, the, and they're Christmas. <gasps> this is incredible. Yes, I realize, you guys always laugh. I read the comments. You guys are like her level of passion when she unboxes things. I know, but either I could do this on my own and my reaction would be the same, or I can do this with you. Look at how, it's like, it has a holly on the top. Oh my goodness, and he's fuzzy. It's a winter pink Christmas cupcake. Oh, I love you. Two, three, four, okay, I got four. Oh, you should have got more. Always, always get more. Fine, we can live in a box, but at least it'll be decorated. This is amazing. I just keep checking if how many I bought. Okay, I got four of this. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. I feel like that. I feel like it's not doing it justice on the camera because it's so flippin' glittery. Oh my god, you are so pretty. You you are beautiful. It's like an iridescent pink. It's so much pretty in real life. I know this. I know this. You're probably like, it's not that nice. It's so pretty in real life. This is gonna be so nice. If I can get that tree to really sparkle, with the multicolored lights, I do think it could work. I could, oh, I could also change the lights. You can completely program the lights. It's, I have like the oldest version of the twinkly tree, but you can still program it. What if I just did straight up pink and green lights? It's an option. More ice cream cones. More ice cream cones. More ice cream cones. Now this, I don't know if this is gonna work, but I was like, if we're gonna do pink and green with a touch of red, we need a touch of red. And I thought these were flippin' adorable. Oh my God, and they're so soft. It's like a Jersey cotton, it feels like a pillow. Oh my goodness. So I would kind of, I think I would like unravel these a little bit just to make it more like large and in charge. I don't know if we wanna do, listen, red and pink and red and purple is my least favorite thing on the planet, but Where's the one, where's the color? Let's see. How does this colorway work? If it doesn't work, I'm taking this out and I'm contributing this to that tree, which as if that tree needs any more. Yeah, it could work. It can work. Okay, you can stay. And we would hope so because I bought a million of you. I didn't stinge. I was in a really good mood when I was ordering. I was like, let's do it up big. A mood, of, a mood of excitement and desperation is not a good combination. These are cute. These are also red, but I mean, okay. This is probably the least well done thing, but from far it doesn't matter. So this is ultimately just like a plastic tube. Like it's almost like, it feels like a little pool noodle that was cut. I thought it would be like covered in something, like a little coating, it's not, but they're little marshmallows with chocolate on top. And I mean, from far, does it really matter? No, because even from here, it looks like a marshmallow. So I'm here for it. Okay, I got four of these. Love you. This is, I thought this was gonna be a quick unboxing. This is wild. Like when I, when I say huge unboxing, hopefully you guys believe me because it's not ending. And I realize I yammer quite a bit, but shoot. Okay, I got, I got, I got five of these five of these and these have green and these are like a fuchsia. I mean, I know they look red, but in fact, in fact, they are not. So green, yeah, okay, I get it on camera, but look at it compared to my, my shirt is red. So there's like pink in this. 
and they're very glittery. So these are supposed to look like little gumdrops. This is Direct Export Company. You probably get it even cheaper if you just order it directly from the source. Write that down. Direct, direct Designer's Excellence by Direct Export Company. Hmm, interesting. That's not where I ordered it from. What's the name of the place I ordered this from? I'll put it in the, I put everything in the description and I always link everything in my stories on Instagram. Story highlights so that you can have it forever and stories daily on Instagram and on my like to know it. Ooh, I like you. Oh, this is very Whoville. <gasps> you know who I am? You know who I am? Martha May Huvier. It just came to me. I need that thing that she shoots the lights with. I am her. These are incredible, right? With the green? Okay. Oh, and I got the same ones. Oh, I just, like, it's hard online when you're, does this work? You're probably like, no, I'll make it work. Okay, so I got green and red also. Oh my God, I'm so nervous, I'm so nervous. And then I got curly cues. Look at what I did. Look, I should have got like a bajillion more of green, but that's fine. Why did I not get, did I really only get, oh, I know what happened, they were sold out. Cause I would have got a bunch of these. Okay, so this is the colorway. Pink and green. Could be an epic disaster or could be incredible. So I got these curly cues. I got these curly cues that have like a glitter finish on them. So these are like, these are almost like flocked, the pink ones. They have like a fuzzy on them. My camera does not want to see, there we go. Fuzzy, don't, don't look at my face. It just wants to show you my face. Don't look at my face. Fuzzy, glitter, and then these are like an iridescent pink color with kind of like a glitter on them. I'm overwhelmed. I'm overwhelmed for you. If you're overwhelmed, I'm overwhelmed. I'm right there with you. This is epic. So they had these in like a red and green and I opted for no. I got this like teal color. I swear, if you hear the doorbell ring with me, you're gonna witness chaos. It's now 416. I'm gonna be so sad if it doesn't get delivered. This is sick. Little gumdrop, little gummy ring, candy. So cute. And I have to say there's not a ton of, you know like when you order stuff and there's like the glue strings from the glue stick, like the glue gun, there's not a ton of that. So I got, how many did I get of that? Six, six of the gummies that we already looked at. Okay, I got a ton of these because again, we needed green, I know. We got a lot of pink. This is so pretty. This is very Grinchy. So I got these like metallic shimmery branches. You know what I like about this company? that I ordered from, a lot of the branches are huge. They're not like tiny little things. They're, they make a, they pack a punch. <gasps> okay, this is not for the, this is not for this tree. This is for the tree that's behind me. So the tree that's behind me is all elf themed and it's chaotic. I made like candy cane grappling hooks. I went full tilt. Um, this, I should have got more of him. This is sick. They're like, like, it's as though like an elf fell in the tree, which I have, but this one is bigger and way better. Bigger, therefore better. So cute. Okay, this is everything. We've come to the end of our gigantic box of stuff. I'm gonna put you in the tree, dear sir. And we're still waiting on FedEx. I'm going to organize all this on the floor in front of that tree. And we will reconvene probably with a cocktail and the other parcel because I can't start this without the other parcel. And I, can't, I also can't tell you what it is until I have it because kind of hard to explain. And also I wanna surprise you. Okay, I'm gonna clean this up and hopefully I'm seeing you again in this outfit on this floor. If not, oh, <laughs> okay. We got a parcel. You wanna do an unboxing? So, it feels like 10 million years later. Obviously the parcel never arrived that day. The amount of refreshing that I did on the tracking number and then it never even arrived the Monday after that and it was like a 24 hour delivery, but it's here one full week and a bit later. Now I need to, I'm not reminding you because you're gonna literally watch me a week ago and I need to remind myself. So I have all of these laid out. These are the colors that I'm going for. This like, what would we call this? Like a Kelly green and a fuchsia. That is the colors that we're going for. I'm all about green this year. And this is the parcel I was waiting on. And it's a lot heavier and bigger than I thought it was gonna be. Here I was thinking this was like a compact way to decorate. No, 
Now, you guys know that I'm all about, unless you're new this year and you're like, wait, she's crazy. I'm all about like organized chaos. This is very chaotic as a concept and there's a lot in this box. So let me show you this. This is what I got. So I Googled extra large Christmas decorations and this came up and then I researched it and they were on Shark Tank, which is kind of cool. So there's these like giant Christmas ornaments that's ultimately like, listen, you could totally DIY this and go buy a bouncy ball from Walmart and spray paint it, but we're not doing that this year. I might need scissors. I can't pop a nail. And I have different nails than the last time you saw. I have like gingerbread, look how cute. My like gingerbread-esque nails, which are not gonna last very long at all. So here's the deal. I was gonna decorate that night, like just dive right into everything that's for and I can't start the tree without these because they're gonna go in and around the tree so it comes with so this is the first color I think you can see I did like a hot like a fuchsia and this is the 30 inch one it's gonna be huge but I'm here for it because organized chaos and then it comes with I'm gonna show you everything it's very cute so there's the ball that you inflate. You can buy the inflator if you want. Hopefully I don't need one. Um, I'm not gonna blow these up by mouth because I think I'd pass out. I have one of those like electric ones that I used to use for our pool. God rest our pool soul. I think I could do that. I hope it works. So the company is called Holly Ball, not sponsored. Just saw it. So I need to blow these. I mean, this is, but here's the, okay. I thought it'd be like more compact. So for storage sake, cause you can deflate these at the end of the year. So the topper goes on and then there's this. Oh, okay. I was actually wondering like to secure it to the tree. I was like, how does it stay in the tree? So there's these picks that comes with it. You guys are invested. There's clear fishing wire-esque stuff. There's this. This is, and then there's this suction thing, and then there's three. Oh my gosh, this feels very MacGyver. I think this goes, I think that's this, and this is how it stays in the tree. Instructions, blow up the, oh, there's also a measuring tape. Did I already, did I toss that? I saw it, I saw it, it's my foot on it, yeah. There's a measuring tape, so that you fully inflate it to the right dimension. Okay, the point of these is if they're on your front lawn. And then you put the rope down and then it's, so we're not doing that. Oh, I really hope that this is easy. Okay, okay, okay. So we have, remember, this is the theme. It's gonna be good. Blading one right now, we're not doing that. That's gonna be for the decorate one. And I'm scared though that there would be, like if there was a hole puncture in here. Oh my God, the color is so good. Like I wanna live in this color. Look at how pretty that is. Oh, so it's like a rubbery, it's, it's a ball. It's a giant bouncy ball. This is huge. That is gonna be mat. This is not going in the tree. This is gonna go around the tree. That was not lost upon me. So here's what I did. The box that I got that was, that came in. Look how many I got. One is never enough. So I did, <laughs> so I did two of the 30 inch ones. And then this is the other color I got, right? How flipping cute. Let me unbox a little one. Is this green? No, this is pink. So I got three, I got three 18 inch ones of pink, three 18 inch ones of green. And then I was gonna get two 30 inch of each, which I just thought was excessive. So we did not do this. I will say their packaging is exquisite. Oh, the packaging is pretty much the colors I'm going for. Green, pink, and a little touch of red. So the green is more like a Christmas green than a Kelly green. The other thing that I still need is ribbon. This is the color, oh, this is so pretty. I wanna show you the pink next to the, this is like a very Christmassy green. That's the green. And then this is what I'm going for. And then let's just show, let's just show the whole palette. What do we think? Are you thinking like, Angie, you're absolutely insane and this is gonna be an absolute disaster? Or are you thinking this is gonna be incredible? Because I really don't know what to think. It's time to get to decorating. 
So I'm going to start with these. <laughs> I'm so overwhelmed. I'm gonna start with these, put them around the tree, put them in the tree, the smaller, let's, the smaller one is going to go in the actual tree. Still huge. This is gonna be huge when I inflate this. So I'm gonna decorate, I'm gonna take you guys with me. If that's something you wanna see, then not just keep watching, but wait for that video, that'll be up soon. And when it is, I will link it below this one if I remember. This is gonna be crazy. So welcome to my 2022 tree drama. I think there was a tree drama last year. I don't remember what the tree drama was. I just know I had a video called tree drama. So if you didn't watch that, you know, every year there's some sort of Christmas chaos that happens, by the way. I think this is my favorite piece from this year. So I'm going to put on a movie, make some hot cocoa, and inflate this and get to decorating. So I will post that video as soon as possible. I decorated the full Disney house. If you guys haven't seen that, I will link that down below. And for the tree drama, I will link that after this video because now I wanna go watch that video and see what the drama was, because I don't remember. And make sure you're subscribed. Thumbs up if you guys liked this. I love sitting down and I, you guys keep asking for longer videos so I know this was a bit of a longer one. We just got to sit, hang out, unbox things and continue the chaos. So I will see you guys very soon. Bye dudes.